mentality that our, our football team has and their willingness to buy into what it is that we're trying to accomplish. It's been 14 years since we've been here. Um, it's not going to be 14 years again until we get back. Coach, your team never trailed a zone drill in class. They played all year long. Uh, probably never trailed as much all year. What do you tell you guys at the halftime to get them to come out and keep on swinging in the second half? The, the message that I gave my guys at halftime was if you have a soul, it has to leave your body on this field. That's it. Whenever you have an opportunity to play because nothing is promised, and, and this game and this opportunity only comes from very few young men and, and very few programs and schools who put the work in to get to that point. I asked my guys to just give me whatever they had for 24 minutes, and we'll just let the chips fall where they may. And they did that for me, and I'm proud of them for that. Questions for any of the players? Uh, just to let you know, there's, there's one uh, I knew he was being treated on. He was requested by the media, but was being received treatment. He just, someone moved on his ankle, but that was, yeah, when he, he was, uh, he was yeah, kind of like the same way. He uh, just had somebody roll on it, that's all. He's a tough kid, he'll be fine. Any other questions, guys? Uh, question for the board. Glad you've been um, on the center for your team now since you were a sophomore, now the junior senior. Uh, can you talk about, I guess, your, your evolution as a player and not all the kids get to start so young and, and the coaches for you to come back you know, this year and come back to next year to try to get back here again? Um, it's just really a growing process. You know, still got to get back to the drawing boards after this season. Still got work to do.